So, last night was a pretty bad night. Um, it wasn't horrible. And I'm not dead, so it wasn't the worst night that it could have been. But, uh, wow. It uh, certainly wasn't fun. Uh, as soon as I uh, got my scent, uh, <laughs> as soon as I got my tent uh, uh, all set up, uh, this bug started just annoying the hell out of me. I don't know what kind of bug it was, and it, but it had a really distinct noise. So, uh, so after that bug uh, was bugging me, it's pretty funny. Um, <laughs> it started to rain. Um, now, I didn't go to... By the time I finally went to sleep, it hadn't started to rain, but uh, probably, I'm guessing, a couple of hours later, um, I woke up to water dripping on my head. Now, I mean, when you think of a tent, what's the first thing that comes to mind? For me, it's shelter. You know, trying to shelter you from the elements and I would think the only one it wouldn't shelter you from is like fire because if you're setting your tent up on a on a fire pit you probably deserve to die I mean so you don't deserve to die but you know the fire you know burning you and all that should probably just happen to you because you kind of saw the fire um, but water I would definitely say tents should be waterproof now I don't know if the box uh, to this tent said it was waterproof. Um, maybe it didn't, but uh, it yeah it it got pretty it, it got pretty wet in there. Not too wet, and it really only got wet in uh, certain locations. But uh, the uh, the tent has uh, little tie ropes. Um, uh oh, oh, I can't get in. Um, uh, the tent has certain tie ropes. Um, so. Uh, uh, so like these, the water would drip down on these um, and uh, get extremely annoying. Now, um, like obviously, like this feels a little damp. I don't know if it really is damp or not. Uh, it always did, so I was just assuming that it probably got through. But the biggest problem is down here. Um, that got really wet. I don't know why. It just did. Um, which sucked because the way I'm sleeping is basically there's my head. And then uh, there's my feet. So, so I woke up to cold feet, cold wet feet. That's really hard to uh, uh, create a remedy for um, because I, I mean I took my shoes off, but I left my socks on because you know I didn't want to smell the place up. Uh, and then I just couldn't get it, so I had to take my socks off. But then my feet were really cold, so I had to uh, open up this like emergency blanket thing, which. Doing that at two or three o'clock in the morning is hard, because um, the thing was wrapped up really well, and it was like plastic, metal. Really, it was I don't know what it was, but it was icky. It was no. Um, either way, I finally did get back to sleep. The tent again isn't like soaking wet. Nothing of mine got like destroyed because of uh, it being damp, but it still sucked a lot. Um, one thing, like a side note, I guess, I mean, it doesn't really suck, but my cell phone, which I've been basically using as my clock and my alarm clock, died last night. Um, which is weird, because I just charged it when I was in the hotel. So uh, I don't really, I don't know why a cell phone would die that easily, but um, it kind of sucks. Um, so yeah, my alarm didn't go off. So I woke up at, um, right now it's about 7. I usually wake up at around 5.30. Um, Maybe six, because that's about dawn. Actually, dawn's a, a little after five. Um, so I was actually worried when I woke up, I'm like, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I need to get out of here, especially, because when you're at a train station, even though uh, it might not be a huge problem, a lot of people are probably gonna see you, at least people on the train, because the train goes right through here. So, um, um, yeah. I'm gonna pack this thing back up, and I hope that this van doesn't scream at me. I don't know, whatever. Whatever, yeah, pack this up, uh, get on the first train out of here to the next uh, JR station, and then uh, figure out how the hell to get to Nagano for my next concert. 
See you guys. Bye-bye. Someone knows where NX E3 uh, Summer Garden is. Yeah, I don't even know the name of the place, so that, that's probably going to be a problem. So, uh, the next hurdle is going to be uh, once I get there, uh, I don't actually have a ticket for the concert. Um, I had to have the uh, publicist for the uh, concert hold the ticket for me. Um, um, yeah, that's going to kind of be a problem. Uh, the last I talked to him, I still have a ticket, but, um, you know, Shit could happen, right? <laughs> so hopefully I get the ticket. Now, above all of that, um, I'm gonna have to find a cheap hotel tonight because uh, uh, that tent is kind of dirty now. And uh, well, I can use it. Uh, I'd much rather not. So uh, the the journey that was nice on uh, begins. That's a movie trailer. Uh, Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go, and uh, I'm gonna go make a reservation uh, to the uh, Nagano area. All right, bye bye. Okay, so I'm waiting in front of customer service. It opens at like 8:30. Um, I don't know if the guy's gonna speak English or not, so it's gonna be extremely hard for me to ask him in Japanese directions to a place that I don't even know the name to. So that might be a problem. So, uh, to kill some time, uh, I just want to talk about the uh, train ride here. Um, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. It was much like the way, uh, you know, through Coma, and just going the opposite direction, big surprise, huh? But it was really early in the morning, and um, it seemed that there were a lot of um, um, uh, people going to school. I mean, as far as I know, it's school vacation still. Um, so I was just assuming maybe prep school, but still, I mean, would it start that early? Um, and then uh, we passed this uh, mountain, um, and there's a, a bunch of clouds around it, it looked really pretty. But uh, what doesn't look as pretty is um, this advertisement. See, I think if these kids would just open their eyes, um, they might be able to get their food to their mouth. <laughs> yeah, that's like, you know, six inches away, lady. I should... <laughs> okay, that's bad. <laughs> okay, okay. Mm, I, I've had enough fun for today. I'm gonna get in here just a little bit. See you guys later. Okay, so I needed to grab some breakfast, so I walked in this noodle shop, and um, mmm, dinner. 